on genre, which also had romance people on it um, at, a, at a, uh, a thing called BookCon in, in Toronto. And so I was just thinking that the romance people must have an even tougher time with it uh, to try to say that what they're doing is worthwhile because it's so much of it is written in formula. But again, there are people who, are, who write things that I would call romances, but who again can say they are not doing that very thing. But I thought I came up with what was a good formula, which is my work, which is genre plus time equals literature. <laughs> so, because Tolkien's in the literature section now, mm -hmm. and he wasn't before, so maybe that helps. As I see him here, he, he was finally won the medal mm -hmm. because he had written enough books that, and, and he had stood the test of time, and enough people liked him, and he did them well enough that people were like, well, it's not too embarrassing, we didn't like him. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and wasn't there a huge kerfuffle on when uh, his bag of bones came out, which I thought was a beautiful book, one of my favorites of his, and I love that book so much. And, and there was a reviewer in Atlantic Monthly or something like that who had said that that book was a more literary and better written novel than Snow Falling on Cedars, which was the darling of the day. <laughs> and everyone went absolutely ape shit. And I, and I was like, yes. <laughs> Um, sure, I think um, that uh, uh, fuck, where, where, um, there, there, there is a kind of built-in resentment among many people who have gotten the world against the word friction. And uh, some, sometimes so the French is to say nobody really reads that stuff. Uh, they, they just pretend they read it. Um, point of view, I've heard over and over that. Um, you don't get very far over that. So, um, yes. Now we don't have much problem, or many, many people don't have much more problems 
would see gender as a kind of fluid, open uh, matter that can be uh, uh, structured individually. And the same thing is happening in Java, which, you know, you say there are no Javas. Um, Working in that direction. Um, the other guest of honor, Gary Wolf, uh, has, has written a, a, a brilliant book called Evaporating Zones that makes it up. It, 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 exactly the same. Um, if, if genres replicate themselves in, uh, to very satisfactory results on them again, you, you, you can get a kind of generation loss that is the, the, the the fifth level of Raymond Chandler novels, the fifth level of Tolkien books, are not actually her. They, 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 they may have those uh, same built-in proof of automatic satisfaction, but they don't have any of the excitement uh, of the stuff of the, you know, the progenitors. Uh, it's much more interesting to see things develop and change than mutate. Um, I think uh, I think that's so, so better. Um, 